Hello everyone, good evening. My name is Debbie Morgan. Now I know many of you recognize me as Angie from All My Children, or perhaps Moselle from East Bayou. Or maybe you've seen your kids watching me playing Q's Mom and Loving Basketball. I've played a wide variety of characters during my career. And for the most part, they've all been a far cry from my own life experiences, and not necessarily in a good way. Now, Jeremy Newkirk is there with you this evening talking about Go Virtual Green, an initiative to stamp out illiteracy, bullying, an initiative to rekindle the human spirit by injecting our kids with positive energy. And if our kids have positive energy, a positive spirit that they can pass on, it just becomes a chain reaction. Children growing up in tough situations that subsequently block their growth, their success, their happiness, is of particular concern to me. I grew up in a home filled with domestic violence, and I lived in constant fear. And it shaped many of the choices I made in life because those choices were based on fear. As a teenager, I was constantly bullied. Later in life, I attracted degenerates into my life. And I was not able to be a free spirit and thrive, which should be every child's birthright. So I've written a book entitled The Monkey on My Back, which spans three generations of women living with domestic abuse, beginning with my grandmother, my mother, and myself. I often refer to it as my ill-fated legacy. It was a long and arduous journey writing this memoir, but it was also a very rewarding journey because it was a healing process, a catharsis which freed me to become the woman I am today, resilient, strong, confident, independent, happy. I can do my happy dance now. It was also written with the intent of mothers and fathers acknowledging the importance of getting children out of domestic environments before it becomes a serious detriment. Because children looking to their parents as role models, children emulating what they see, can often become the abused or the abuser. And so I recognize and understand the urgency for children to be given a chance to succeed, for them to be instilled with positive energy, and to be presented with the tools in helping them discover their own humanity. Before I go, I just want to say that my memoir, The Monkey on My Back, can be purchased at Barnes & Noble bookstores or on Amazon.com. I'm also touring a one-woman show of the same title based upon my book. I would love to bring it to Atlanta and share it with all of you. Now, although it's based on a serious subject matter, it's also filled with a ton of belly laughs because I am brutally honest talking about my life, the good, the bad, the ugly, the outrageous, and may have many of you saying, not Debbie Morgan. <laughs> Goodbye and enjoy the rest of your evening.